it's time to bundle up, grab your friends and family, get out of the house for an afternoon of live music, winter activities, and pairing brews at the Ice Jam Winter Festival. It's a family-friendly event, and it's partnering with a very well-known local charity to make an event even even bigger impact. Here with more, Lindsay and Ashley. Good morning, Lindsay. Good, Good morning, morning, Ashley. Morning. Lindsay from Perrin, Ashley from Kids Food Basket, the charity that I was referring to. Thanks for being here. So, yeah, Lindsay, you. four years you've been doing this. Yeah, absolutely. With Kids Food Basket, the Ice Jam. So much more than just a good time, but let's start with the good time stuff. Yeah, right. absolutely. So it's our fourth year um, that we've came together for this event. It's an awesome outdoor event to kind of when you get those winter crazy blues and you gotta get, <laughs> yeah. get out of the house for Cabin a little bit. Cabin fever, right? Absolutely. So we have a large heated tent where we have four bands that will be forming live music. Freshly beer on tap with brand new stuff coming out, like this carrot cake cream ale we've got here. Well, we're going to talk about that. Absolutely. <laughs> and, um, of course, all proceeds go right back to Kids Food Basket. Okay. We were just talking, Ashley, about Kids Food Basket yeah. and how how prevalent it is in our community. Like, it's, a, it's surprising to find people who don't know what Kids Food Basket does. But once again, we're going to talk about it in case they're out there. So tell yeah. people what you do. So we are an organization that is nourishing kids to reach their full potential, and we do that by serving about 8,800 evening meals every single weekday in West Michigan. Mm -hmm. And so while there are a lot of people who know about us, the need is still really, really great, and we want to make sure that the kids in our community get what they need to thrive. Yeah, that food insecurity is what we're talking about. Yeah. So when they're, when they're out of school before dinner, they might not be getting that great dinner, you send them home with a, what, a paper bag full of good food, right? Yep, it's a sack supper. It's an evening meal. Again, it's just Designed to really make sure kids have access to good, healthy, nourishing food, um, fresh fruits, fresh vegetables, proteins, and really have access to the food that they need to have full brain development. That's important, though. Obviously, every parent wants that for their child, and mm -hmm. it's so it's just frustrating sometimes. You see that the food that might not be the best for you is usually the cheapest food out there. Yeah. So the stuff that's good for you tends to cost more. You're making sure that they get that food, that Absolutely. those fruits and vegetables. So thank you for what thank you, you do, and parent, thank you for what you do. Yeah. <laughs> Because you're making stuff like <laughs> carrot cheese cream, uh, what carrot cake? Carrot cake cream. I said cream. Ale. I said cream cheese because I want. We were talking about the frosting <laughs> earlier. Okay, so talk about this carrot cake cream ale. Yes, this is our um, side hustle that's releasing um, on Ice Jam. So it actually was brewed with over seven actual carrot cake sheet cakes. Okay, I want people um, to picture this. Yes. Okay, so they. Where'd you get the cakes? We got them from Arnie's Bakery. Love Arnie's Bakery. Yep, local okay. right here. So Arnie's brought over a bunch of carrot cakes. Absolutely. And you dumped them into? Right into the mash. <laughs> so right into the beer. So that cream cheese frosting is right inside oh, is the it? Beer. With frosting? Oh, absolutely. Oh, it's okay. a whole cake. Oh, it's a whole know. cake right in there. <laughs> so the whole cake goes into the mash. and then it, So the flavor, obviously, you're going to get notes yes. of, uh, of sweetness. Yep, good sweet, spice, kind of the carrot pineapple characteristics to it. So it's like you're pouring out. A slice of cake. Oh right into a my glass. goodness! Cake, a pint <laughs> glass of cake. It's delicious. Perrin, stop! No, don't stop! Don't stop! All right. So Saturday, January twenty fifth is when all of this action is happening. That's uh, people. Now wait, can people try this cream ale be before the nope. event? Saturday. So this is it. Saturday. So what? So what's on our table right here? Nobody can even get. Not till Saturday. <laughs> okay. So all you have to do. I didn't do that. So I didn't the, see it. Didn't <laughs> it's actually cold, too. I love it. It's actually cold. So how do people get in the ticketed, uh, the price for admission? Yep, you can go online to perrinbrewingcompany.com slash events, mm -hmm. or you're welcome to stop into the pub, purchase a ticket, or bring in a bag of food items, which will also be kind of your ticket right into the party. And I'm sure there's a list of uh, food items that you're looking for on Kids Food Basket you, website? Yep, you can go to our website, kidsfoodbasket.org, and look at our wish list, and I believe it is also on Perrin's website as well. Okay, so one of those two websites is going to have everything you need, but uh, the good time is waiting for you at the Ice Jam Festival yes. with the live music, the heated tent, so you'll be in comfort. Yep. And of course, all the family-friendly activities to bring the kids. Yes. Right. Yep. Kids will have stuff We're to do. We're supporting kids, so bring the kids. Yeah, kids. this isn't just for the grown-ups; it's for everybody. So <laughs> yes. thanks again, Lindsay Thank and you. Ashley. Thank you. Check it out, parentbrewing.com for more information. Next on the morning mix, if you're new.